hear me? Yes. yes. Good. Well, I have a couple of jokes for you tonight. And the um, first one is about a Quaker farmer. And this Quaker farmer lived out in the wilds of Iowa, and lots of cornfields all about. And they'd all settled in for a nice evening of sleep. And about, a midnight, about midnight, he heard this knock on the door, big knock on the door. And it was real sleepy and everything, but, you know, farmers usually have guns because they have to shoot some animals sometimes. So he grabbed his gun, thinking somebody was trying to break in his house. And he got to the top of the stairs, and he looked down the stairs, and there stood a man in the moonlight, in the middle of his doorway. And you know what he said? He said, I don't like to kill anybody, but I'm about to shoot where thee is standing. (laughs) 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 So, what would you get if you crossed a Quaker with a Seventh Day Ad with a uh, Jehovah's Witness? You get somebody who comes and knocks on your door, and then when you open it, he just stands there and doesn't say anything. <laughs> Okay, so there was this uh, guy who was driving along in a van out in California on one of the freeways, and he was really speeding. He was going about 80 miles an hour, and pretty soon he heard this behind him, and up came a policeman and said, you know, you're really driving fast. He said, well, I was only driving 80 miles. He was said, you were driving 90 miles an hour. And he looked in the van and he said, what are all those penguins doing in the back of the van? I think you better take them to the zoo. So the guy said, he let him off, you know, he didn't give him a ticket or anything, so he let him off and the guy drove off with the penguins in the back of his van. Next day, same policeman, same... St- same highway, same 90 miles an hour, and the policeman pulled him over and said, what are you doing here? I thought I told you to take those penguins to the zoo. And the man said, yeah, we, I did, and they had such a good time, I'm taking them to the beach. <laughs> thing I have is a song that I learned from a friend of mine who lived at my house for a while. And and this song is a song about people going into meeting and somebody having eaten too much and his stomach was rumbling, you know. Has your stomach ever rumbled when you have eaten too much or something? You're so embarrassed because here's this noise. So this is the song. I sat down in meeting with thee, prim and proper as a Quaker could be. Thy rumblings abdominal were simply phenomenal, and everyone thought it was me.